Hi everyone, Anita Fanita here. How is everybody? <laughs> My voice is a little bit, you know, weird because uh, I do have allergies and uh, I'm going through a, a sneezing and sniffling and, you know, my sinuses are closed, but I do have two jewelry jars. Okay, about the jewelry jars, uh, one of them here, this one is closed. This one is $24.99. And this one here was $19.99, but my dad couldn't wait to open it. <laughs> so he did open it. In a way, I'm glad he opened it because it's filled with all of the same things. It's like a deja vu jar. And it is the size of a bucket. It's huge. And it's $19.99. And when I open it right now and show you what's in it, you'll know uh, what I mean by it's the same things over and over. Okay. Uh, it has these things. <laughs> They're fashion uh, earrings. And these things in the back are plastic. So, I don't know. I don't really like these. I don't think I'm going to list these. So, there was three of these. No, four. I'm sorry. Four. <coughs> and I will be coughing and sneezing throughout. So... <laughs> Okay, so these, and some of them are stuck on top here. Okay, and there's a whole bunch of these. These are bracelets. Let's see if you can see them here. Okay, they are bracelets, you know, those kind that you pull closed. And they're still in their packages. I mean, there's a lot of these uh, ones with the crosses. And then there's some with flowers. And again, over here with the cross. Yeah. I'm glad he opened this one actually, because imagine if I was opening it and going through it and it's all the same thing. Okay, and then there's these uh, cancer ribbon ones that, you know, you close this way, and then, oh, this one is broken, but there's more of the same thing, so, okay, okay, so these rings here, they're butterflies, adjustable, really cute uh, blingy rings, and this jar is like all of it so and they are all in good uh good good condition except for this one that was missing it's not even missing it's inside i guess it fell uh, off of it but everything all of the other ones are good so <clears throat> and then yeah more this one is a blue flower and then there's a bunch of these ones here with the heart so they're all like fashion jewelry see it's filled with the, this flower it comes in the white and it comes in the gray Where's the gray one? <laughs> Here. See, this is the gray one. And they're not bad. I mean, they're cute. I know these are like at the, you know, the fashion uh, clothing stores. They have these at the counters for about $5 each, sometimes even more. So, oh, the ones that I, I, was, I really, really loved were these ones. A lot of them. Cute little owl adjustable rings. Very cute. And my daughter already snatched two of these. But, you know, this jar was already, uh, it's gone through. But I wanted to show you guys what was inside. So, yeah, more of these and, you know, these. I'm not sure what to do with them because there's a lot of them. And if you guys have any ideas, please let me know because there's so many of them. I don't know if I should make lots or I'm not quite sure what to do with them. But the owls are really cute. I mean, the butterfly is cute, too. It's very nice, like... This one here, the, the black uh, grayish one, really cute. See, these are what they look like. So, I don't know. So, this whole jar is filled with uh, those and these and the flowers. There's just a couple of earrings uh, left and right, but um, it was mainly these things. <laughs> oh, my God. I just realized that the owl, some of them are yellow, the, uh, the wings, and some of them are pink. So, yeah, and then these, and let's see what else was in here. Um, okay, and these over here. Let me show you this one here. Uh, it's a stretchy, and all of them are different. It's This one says pets. Um, this one doesn't have the tag. The other one, all of them did have the tags except for that one. This one says electric uh, panorama, and... This one says Electric Collectibles. So there's a whole bunch of these bracelets in here too. And and these cancer ribbons. So, yeah. And, the, and there's one in the All the way through. So, only thing in here that wasn't um, that one, one of these, was this one that I liked. And it did have the pair where it go. 
and I'm keeping these for me and look how cute these are they say under a spell really cute for especially for Halloween I don't know if you can see it but that's what it says under a spell very cute I'm keeping these for me for Halloween yeah so a whole bunch of these so yeah let me put these away yeah and the and the hearts the butterflies <laughs> and the owls so and yeah and the cancer ribbon and oh look guys look <laughs> so many of them so yeah and there was three of these these are really cute there was three of them in here these are pretty too they're beaded flowers bracelets see more of these and yeah all the way full with, with these basically so i'm not going to say it's a bad jar because for 20 dollars it's pretty good oh and these rings and there's a lot of these rings it's not it's not real it kind of looks like a like a like a jade on here and kind of like a teardrop uh shape but there's a bunch of these in here too so yeah guys give me some ideas on what to do with all this should i make lots are you guys interested in these i don't know um uh, yeah this one it was in here too this one is really cool uh but this is only there was only one of this uh it's a very interesting ring here look how nice it is it's a fashion ring it says size 19 i don't know what size 19 is but i'm pretty sure it's not ring size 19. it's probably an eight <laughs> So, yeah, let me know what to do with these, and then we're going to open the other jar right now. Okay, so, yeah, these go back in. Oops, I'm going to get rid of them. Hang on. <laughs> oh, when, they, when jars have things like this, I really don't know what to do with them, because, I don't know, especially with these kinds of jewelry. Oh, God, let's see. Yeah, there's a lot, and it just got snacked to my towel. Yeah, I, I might make lots, or... Do a giveaway. Oh, that's an idea. That's an idea. Do you know, maybe a giveaway and put one of each and then some other stuff. That's, that's a good idea. I just thought of that right now. Okay, and these cute little owl rings. Okay. So, yeah, let's get these out of the way so we can do an actual other jar here. Let me cut this here. I'm cutting my towel. <laughs> Well, it's not coming off. <laughs> okay. Oh, boy. And it, and, and, the, and the jar was the size of a bucket, I'm telling you. Okay, so this one here is $19.99 over here. And I can't really see anything nice through it because it has, the you know, the, the kind of like the tree uh, bark looking um, glass here. So let's just open it up. My scissor seems to be stuck. Oh, there we go. And I have my loop. So let's see what's in here. Do not disappoint us, Goodwill. Okay. So the other jar was pretty good for $19.99 for all that stuff. Not bad. Okay, so this one is $19.99. And then let's see what's in here. Okay, there's something stuck to the lid. Okay, we have this. Uh, our heart our choice uh go red a little red dress uh pin and something else is stuck here okay. um are these real or yeah they're pretty cold i'm not sure if they're real turquoise though it's kind of like the floating necklace in uh turquoise color beads i'm not sure if they're real turquoise i don't think they are because of the of the clasp so yeah okay we have that what's this this is pretty uh we have a snowflake uh a brooch it's in gold tone and i don't see any markings let me see if it's working and it's definitely working it's pretty good not bad and we have earrings on a card this fashion earrings have these it's not bad it's pretty cute okay. they're kind of like copper uh, color earrings I'm not sure if they're real copper pretty cute 
Okay, uh, we have an Alex and Ani style bracelet, only it's not Alex and Ani. Uh, no tags, and this one here is a locket. I want to break my nails. Let me see if I can open it. Sometimes when I open lockets, I see pictures in there. <laughs> I hope there's no picture in here. Oh, it's not even opening. Yeah, it's not opening. It may not be a real locket, so it's not opening. And we have a bracelet here. It looks kind of like silver. Let's check my loop. And it says Korea. So, um, I don't think it's silver. I don't have my magnet here. Let me get it. One second. Okay. Nope. Okay. But this is definitely not silver, so I'm just going to put this in the craft pile. But I will test it just before I throw it in. Um, yeah, just these are real stones. They're really cold, but they're missing rhinestones in here, so I'm going to put this in crafts also. Another craft item. That's pretty cool. Oh my god, look at that. What is going on here? Uh, somebody must have made uh, this part too. So, uh, Okay, we'll see if we have the other pair and then we'll decide. Uh, a necklace here with a barrel clasp and some kind of bead. Okay, we'll just keep it for now. That's pretty. Have a bangle. Kind of looks plasticky. Okay, there's something inside. Uh, it says TB5220. $70. I don't think so. Oh, hang on here. There's a little. Okay, it says Alexis Batar. E I T T A R. Okay, I don't know who that is, but I will look it up. It's pretty cool. I like how like uh, it's it's giving the uh, the colors are kind of like a pearlish color, where it's like giving this kind of uh, you know a cotton candy kind of glow. Not bad, but it is plastic. So I'll look it up. I don't know who that is. Okay, what in the world is this? Okay, hang on. I thought it was an earring. <laughs> Imagine if this was an earring. Okay. okay there's, there's another one. I don't know how you would wear this, but let's see. Oh, okay. I see what happened here. Okay, so this goes here to close it as a clasp. And something must have broken here uh, that attaches these two. So I'm going to put this in crafts. <laughs> Or make earrings out of them. <laughs> oh my god. Okay. That's cute. Okay. It's a star earring. Not bad. Okay. We'll see if we have another one. Oh, stars. Another star. Okay. This one has the pair. It's pretty cool. Okay. So we have star earrings. I'm not sure what it's made of. Uh, kind of looks like... Uh, Pewter a little bit, but uh no no markings okay, but they're cute still okay okay oh, another star okay so we have a bunch of stars here okay it's just a dangly star here no marks and it did pick up oh here's the other one okay we have the other one. Hmm. Tangled. Okay, so we have another star earring here. Another star. <laughs> okay, what's with all the stars? Okay, what is this one here? It's tin. Okay, and it has a chain, a broken chain. And let's see if there's any, there's any marks here. Let's see. I always check these ends over here in case I miss a mark. Nope, nothing there. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> okay, I'm going to put this in crafts also. Oh, here's the other star. Okay, so we have the pair uh, for this star here. 
Okay, so we have three star earrings so far. And then we had uh, this one here, the snowflake. It's cute. Okay, what is going on here? Okay, okay, here's a rosary with hematite beads. Kind of heavy. And let's see what it says. It says Jerusalem and nothing on the side and this side says Terra Jerusalem and what is this it looks like crushed what is in here is it kind of looks like a crushed brick it looks like a crushed uh, brick in here I'm not sure what th what that means or what it is actually hmm is it brick is it powder it looks like brick i don't think you guys can see this because it's very little but if anyone knows what that crushed brick or maybe it's some kind of um sand or it's a brick color so i don't know what it is but let me know if you know it's pretty cool never seen one like that before okay uh we have a bracelet with lots of hearts. And you guys know that I really already love this. And it has blue beads. Stretchy. It's not all stretched out. So that's pretty cute. I like that. And it has the poofy hearts here on here. Uh, obviously, they're not silver. But do you think they're silver? No, I don't think they are. No, it's picking it up. No, but it's still cute. I just need to wash it. Very nice. Just run it under some soap and water. <laughs> okay, what do we have here? Okay, we have two tangled. What? All right. I don't think I'm going to be able to undo this. So it looks like two necklaces. One is of a cherub. Here, it's a little cherub, and let's see if it's marked here. I don't see anything. No markings whatsoever. Okay, and okay, the magnet is picking it up. Okay, and this is of uh, hmm, what's this, guys? I think something fell from the back. Something is missing here. Must have been some kind of stone or shell. Oh, it's not there anymore. Ah, yeah, it's picking this up too. So I'm just going to put these two in crafts. Okay, we have an earring shaped like a bow. Okay, we have a keychain, Paris. <laughs> okay, I should I should do a, a, a keychain uh, lot. <laughs> An earring. Okay. What is this here? Okay, it's a very long necklace here. And it has a hair at you. Oh. Okay, the beads are not cooled. And I don't know if I should throw this in crafts or the garbage. I don't want to touch the hair. I'm just, oh, no, 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 no. Uh oh, no. I'm not touching it anymore. Okay. That's pretty. Uh, it's an earring. There's a key and it says love. Okay, and what's this here? And another earring. Uh, it's okay. All right, there's these huge beads. Kind of like a um, um, pomegranate color. They are made of plastic. And this is how they tie. It's a piece of velvet. And, hmm, I don't know. Okay. This, you guys don't even want to see what I'm looking at right now that's coming out next. <laughs> okay, look. Uh, okay, uh, this must have been, been filling up the whole jar. Okay, these are the, you know, the beads that you guys, uh, I don't, I'm not sure what they're called. Uh, they're not beads, uh, but they, they have these at the souvenir stores in Hawaii. <laughs> I, f I forgot what they're called. 
but yeah they're pretty big and you know and something you would wear there but I don't know where else you can wear this but they are good for filling up jars apparently okay oh that's cute we have a little apple uh, brooch here okay I see something oh it's just a number it says 0439 okay not bad a good teacher's gift Okay, we have a broken necklace and let's see no marks and yep that that explained it all <laughs> oh okay we have a brass keynote on a chain okay and that's not bad okay i'm gonna put this in keep okay we have a clip here what is what is going on here okay what is this here? How does this even come off? Okay, okay, that must be stuck in here. Um, hmm. There we go. Okay, it came off. It's a keychain shaped like a fish, kind of, and it says, uh, what does it say? My eyes really cannot see. It says Recuerdo de El Salvador. Uh, de Cameron El Salvador. Okay, so it's a souvenir uh, keychain from El Salvador, is what I would imagine. And I'm not sure what that says. Okay, so this goes in my keychains. <laughs> oh, that's cute. Uh, it's a key. Uh, looks like something that needs to be in crafts. Cute. I'm gonna, well, I'm gonna put it in crafts. Well, actually, I'm gonna put this in my beads. You know how I had all those beads that came out of that one jar? Well, well not one jar. That was three jars or four. And I'm gonna put this in there for crafting. Another watch here. My watch pile is getting bigger and bigger. Okay, what does that say? And Klein, and it's broken. Yeah. Okay. So this goes in the watches. Okay. We have a necklace here with black beads and no marks. Okay. So keep. And we have a little round uh, rhinestone uh, necklace here, and it's broken. No, it's not broken, is it? Nope. It's not broken. Okay, looks like somebody made this, so I'm going to put it back with the crafts. <laughs> okay. Oh, that's cute. That is cute. Okay, somebody made this, looks like, and it's a cute little fish. And it has a little pearl hanging on the bottom over here. So I guess uh, you can make something similar to this with the key. Yeah, that's pretty cool. Okay, that's cute. Hmm. I'm going to put this in the keep pile and see if it cleans up. It's a little bit dirty over here, but I'm going to try and clean it. Okay. Something with a little paper here, and it's broken. A little flower. Uh, can it, it can be fixed. Okay, it can be fixed. Not bad. Okay. But, you know, it's just a little tiny flower, so I'm going to put this here. When I have time, I will fix it. And here's the other earring that was in the other jar, the other pair. And okay, we have another earring here, and it's a little. Hmm. Well, picked it up. Let's see if there's any writing on the earring. Nope. Okay, so I'm just gonna put this in crafts. Okay, we have a necklace with black beads. Okay, no writing. Okay. It's not bad. There's nothing wrong with it, so I'm just going to put it in the keep. And this is already coming apart. Yeah, I'm going to put this in crafts. Another necklace. Black beads. Not any stones. Just a strand of black beads. Oh, I'm just going to put this here, and I don't know yet. <laughs> okay, we have the letter Y. 
and oh okay it has rhinestones on one side and just the Y on the other and I guess this was once a keychain so I'm just gonna put this back into craft and what is this this is pretty it's not any kind of stones but it has kind of like a marble look to it and it's in gray color it's not bad it's pretty actually and it has a does have a clasp so yeah I'm gonna put this in the keep pile it's, it's not bad it's pretty cool I like the way the colors are it has the little swirls that make it look like marble okay uh, it's a stretchy uh, not sure what it's made of but there's nothing wrong with it and it has quite a bit of stretch left oh there is something wrong with it it's broken here so okay Oh, okay, so it goes in crafts. Oh my god, oh, almost go gone and I haven't found anything exciting. Okay, uh, seashell, uh, shell, not seashell, shell, uh, stretchy here. Uh, and I had one just similar to this in a jar, maybe like seven, eight jars ago. So it's the same one, only that one was falling apart and broke. And I did use it for crafts, so yeah I don't know this one is okay it has a lot of stretch to it so I'm gonna put this in keep and this is a ring somebody made put a lot of time into it <laughs> red stones and another red ring that somebody made and okay I'm just gonna put this in gifts where I give out as gifts what purchases so nothing too exciting uh, in this jar uh, what was I going to do? Oh, yeah. I was going to look this up and see what this is. What else was I going to look up? Hmm. Well, there wasn't much to look up, so let's just look this up. And I'm trying to think, was there anything that I was going to look up also? Nope. Okay, so let's just look this up. I'm going to put you on hold for a second and see what this is. Hang on. Hi, everyone. Uh, so I'm back, and I turned the air on because it was hot, <laughs> and I did get excited. So uh, this spangle is uh, quite pricey. Uh, I did find uh, the same, not the same exact one, but I did find similar items here. Okay. Hang on. Okay. So uh, the closest I came to was this one. It says 59 here on this one. So I'm thinking that they range in prices about 30 to $70, depending on what a person is looking for. And uh, the jar was uh, $24.99, and this alone, you know, may made up for the, for the jar. And I got a whole bunch of other uh, cute stuff that I like, uh, especially this cute little fish, and, uh, and, you know, the star earrings were nice. And I had fun opening this jar. I hope you guys had fun also. Thank you for everybody who joined in. Thank you very much uh, for watching. This is Anita Fanita saying goodbye.